middleweight division. The fighter standing in that blue corner. He weighed in at 75.1. He's at 29 and stands at 6 foot tall. He fights out of Haywood Combat and hails from Haywood Nathan Bennett. And his opponent standing in the red corner. He weighed in at 76 kilos. He's 25 and stands at 5 foot 11 inches tall. He fights out of the Sapphire Emma May that hails from the Rotten Storm, Danny Bassford! Your referee, Mr. Craig Lawrence. So the third bout of the evening in the first of the semi-professional rules. So semi-professional, this is headshots standing, no headshots on the ground, so we should see some leather thrown in his fight. Now, I saw Nathan Bevan in his last fight. He took on a very, very tough fighter. He got blasted out quickly. So he will be wanting to <laughs> not get caught quick. And he got caught by a left shot very, very quickly there. And it lets him get back up to his feet. Wise movement. He knows he's got the power in his shots. So he might as well throw. Nathan Bevan sporting that UFC tattoo on his chest. Clearly lives and breathes this sport. And he's going for that left hook over and over. Yep. He's found his, he's made his mark, he's just going to keep throwing them, le them shots, their big hard shots. And don't, he's died for the takedown, why would you do that? I, why would you do that? So, he's, so he was landing quality shots, each shot was landing clean, having an impact, he's gone for the takedown and now it's evens. Side control position, he is caught with that head, that head arm. Now, what uh, Danny could be doing from that position is looking for the uh, Von Flew choke. That will work from this position very well. That's what he's looking for there. He needs to carry on putting that pressure over his shoulder. He's giving that up. He's got. Was Danny? I put the forearm across the face, trying to try and break away with some um, neck pressure. Yeah, you, there's a couple of things you can do from here. He's trying to Von Flew choke. There is. <coughs> There is the possibility of looking for uh, the uh, Kimura by pushing the arm off your head and then as you say put some pressure across the face to try and get some space. But he's out of there now. He's looking for the reverse triangle. These don't work, do they, Saul? <laughs> <laughs> so your favourite submission is... <laughs> Switching to the Kimura as well. Oh, he's got to finish this. That's two, two submissions in one. And there you go. Quick finish there. Nathan must, be, Nathan must be disappointed now. That's two losses on the bounce. He didn't really do much on the ground though. He wasn't shrimping, escaping. He was just no. there. He, lo he lost the stand up. He got caught with some big shots. And on the ground, he looked out, out of place on the ground as well. So I think he's still got a bit of work to do in the gym to live up to that tattoo across his chest. But he's, <laughs> you know, he's making his moves. And uh, this is semi professional. So. You know, hopefully we'll see him have some success in the future. And well done to uh, Danny Brelsford from Sapphire Gym for his result.